So we're gonna do a little education on what to expect when um, figuring out the relationship between the merino wool liner and the leather shell. Okay, so you've just received these um, fresh new pair of gloves and you're gonna find that they're gonna fit tight at first, um, but what you'll notice is after a little bit of wear, um, the liner will relax and settle into the leather shell. We've designed the liner to be loose fitting. So as you can see here, there's a little bit of extra breathability in the liner. It's, it's designed not to be a super snug fitting um, glove. So that way, when you're taking your glove on and off with the liner in it, it stays inside the liner. Um, at first, you're gonna notice it's gonna feel a little bit tight until you break the leather shell in. We recommend that you wear the leather shell without the liner for a little bit and break it in, really make it conform to the shape of your hand and then add the liner. So you'll see here, it's, it, it just looks a little bit tight overall. But um, after, you, after you continue to wear it and you hold the tips of your fingers for those first handful of uses, the liner will stay in the glove. We made the elastic in the wrist not to be super tight fitting so that way it'll stay in the glove rather than you know clamp down on your hand. So that's a new glove and you'll see after you wear this liner for a while and you put it in a well-worn broken in pair of gloves it actually fits rather nicely. Um, and it stays in there much better as well. Uh, so that's, that's the relationship between the merino wool liner and the leather shell. And we just, want you to be, we just want you to know that you have to break the glove in to get these to perform nicely together.